I'm Josh Feingold, Solutions Manager at Tom Sawyer Software. Today, I get to show you something new. Our model-based engineering module is the first of a new breed of solutions that provide advanced capabilities for specific user domains. These modules can be used out of the box as solutions while retaining all the customization and rapid development support Tom Sawyer Perspectives veterans have come to expect. Tom Sawyer Perspectives already provided industry-leading technology for automatic diagram layout and rendering, and we've been working hard fine-tuning that for the special needs of eight standards-compliant SysML diagram types. A block definition diagram, an internal block diagram, a package diagram, a requirements diagram, a basic activity diagram, an activity diagram containing swim lanes, a parametric diagram, simple state machine, and a use case. The model-based engineering module has two out-of-the-box integrations with no magic technologies. One is a plug-in-free HTML and JavaScript web integration with Teamwork Cloud. The other is a plugin for MagicDraw, which we're looking at now. If you already have a diagram, for example, this one in MagicDraw, and you wish to display it using a somewhat different rendering style, you can do that by simply right-clicking on it and saying, Render as Tom Sawyer Perspectives Diagram. What this does is create an alternative rendering of the diagram based on the underlying model. Here we extract the elements that were displayed in the other version of this diagram and show them using the SysML or UML style. You can also transform this into a more user-friendly visual style for your less SysML savvy colleagues. If you want to have a representation that lies somewhere in the middle, you can switch back to our textual style and simply change the settings to show a different set of details within each of the nodes. Powerful automatic layout technology means that once you've refined your diagram to the state you'd like it, you don't have to manually rearrange all of the blocks on the screen. The technology takes care of that for you. The other main paradigm for creating diagrams is to navigate the underlying model and extract the diagram using a known pattern. In this case, we select the power subsystem and navigate the model to find all of those blocks connected to it. We retain the same capabilities to change the UI style, zoom in, and explore any particular element of interest. In addition to creating a block definition diagram, we could say that we want to see this power subsystem's internal block diagram. Here again, we use a known pattern to navigate the underlying model and extract the elements required to represent the internal block diagram. We have the ability to explore this internal block diagram or even expand and collapse particular elements in order to show their internal details. Here we are in Safari, and we're going to explore the web front end available with Teamwork Cloud. We've already uploaded a project to Teamwork Cloud using Nomagic's standard mechanisms for doing so. We have a couple of projects up here, and we're going to open our hybrid sport utility vehicle, the same one that we were looking at before. In this case, we're going to select a package diagram. Within this package diagram, we can see the containment relationships are being viewed as edges. For example, connecting this HSUV views package to the views and viewpoints contained within it. We can change that topology on the fly by clicking on the HSUV views and saying that we want to have a nesting containment style instead. When we do so, the diagram automatically updates and we can change the layout to clean up that containment. Finally, let's circle back to the original block definition diagram 
we had been viewing in Magic Draw, just to show that all the same capabilities that were available in desktop are also available in the web. The same interactive zoom, search capabilities, as well as the ability to adjust settings and layouts on the fly. Thanks for watching, and visit us at tomsawyer.com to learn more.